Hi, Curtis here at Air Champ Lofts. Let me warn you before I start this video that this cock, he is restless. His name is Piper, Pied Piper. He is a different cock and comes from really, really, really good stock. And he's not gonna stay in this box for the entirety of this video because that's just who he is. And if he does, yeah, I'll be grateful, but I'm telling you, he's a lively one. He never stays put. I'm a very intelligent cock. His father, DV02910152, Crazy Bird, winner of 17th, final and third overall average speed, 2015, 2016, South African million dollar pigeon race. There were only 43 day birds in that race in that day. His father's crazy bird. His, his father's brother is Black Champ, winner of ninth final and fourth overall average speed, 17 day birds, <clears throat> just a year before. So both his father and his uncle placed really well in that race, had really ex, ex, uh, excellent average times. <clears throat> and on the mother side, his mother is Hall of Fame. Mm, no, his mother is um, AU 2014 ARPU 109966. Her name is Another Sister Last One. She's a full sister to AU Hall of Fame Limited Edition Gold 0016. Their mother is also a Hall of Fame. Limited edition 8153. It is said by some that these are the best Oscar difference in the United States. I have proof of that, that they have no quit in them. No quit. I look at one of I looked at one of um, a different bird, Oscar different bird that I had that I released. Uh, the Love Fly for the first time. Uh, I had her as a youngster and I, I released her. I, I kept her all in all summer and I released her about a month and a half, two months ago. And she literally, she stayed out overnight, but I could see her looking for this loft. I could see her looking for this loft, and that night I didn't really get very much sleep. And I know she would come the next day, but I could see her looking, I could see her flying, and then she would go out into the distance, and she would disappear, and then she would come back around in the air, looking, looking, looking. I hadn't, I hadn't trapped trained her, I just knew she would be home. Uh, eventually, I saw her when it was just about very dark. And that was the last I saw of her for that night. I knew she would be here the next morning. I knew she would find, a, find, a, find a, the loft. And next morning, early I woke up, I opened my loft doors, my trap doors, and she didn't come. It was 8, 9, around 10 o'clock in the morning. I was in the loft. I heard something on top of the loft. I knew it was her. I didn't have to go look, but I did. And there she was. And the rest is history. From that point on, uh, that was um, around August, or maybe even early September. From that point on, she has already flown, right? She has already flown for me 150 miles. She has gone to 150 mile toss, okay? Now, I will, I will be honest, out of 12 birds, she came She came home the, the ninth bird, but she was the last bird to be to be loft broken, if you want to call it that. She was the one, right? And, sh and she's related to this bird. Uh, and so these birds are very, very persistent and consistent. I'm surprised. That this little dude here, whom I bought as a hen, turned out to be a very nice cock. I'm surprised that he's still sitting in the box, which is great for me. I don't have to chase him all over. But as you can see, P Piper is a very beautiful cock. Excellent breeding eyes. Really nice qualities that you want in a bird. I got her, which turned out to be a him, uh, to put onto my, some of my kittle birds. And I'm still going to do that. I have perfect hands for him. I will be selling a few youngsters from these hands, from these pairs next year. These birds are all winners. I, I intend to probably send out six to eight birds in one love races next year. And I, I'm almost certain that I will come back with some kind of good result. And for me, that would be the start of my racing career as a, a second timer around, you know. Everyone knows that who look at my videos that I just started back in birds this year in uh, March 2022. 
uh, I've invested quite a bit to get some of the best birds that, that I can put my hands on um, without without breaking the bank. And I think I have enough good foundation birds now that I can have something really nice at Air Champ Loves and um, take it from there. But this is one of the cocks that I'm really depending on this year. Pied Piper. Very, very flighty bird. I know he, he, I told you he wouldn't stay. Let me get another angle. He's trying to get there. Very nice little cock, very nice little cock. Thanks for watching this video. I appreciate you. Piper is about ready to get in there with the other guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take, take these pedigrees now and I'm gonna open this. Let them all come in. You guys can see how they do. I'll let them all come into the, the loft. You guys will be able to see them. And I think I have a visitor at my front door. But just so you can see them all going after the video. That's what they do. They're all going after the video and get to the, claim their boxes and so on and so on. And I love it. Okay, thanks for watching this video. I appreciate you. Curtis at Air Champ Loves. Bye bye.